what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here we're going to talk about chucky season four in this video here today so we did actually get something reputable this month uh now the beyond reporter had stated that we would get some type of announcement about a renewal this month we haven't gotten that we did end up though getting something from deadline today in which it's stating the fate of chucky which is shared by which is shared by sci-fi and usa and whose renewal is pending is still to be determined now see i will say this this means that the show of course has not yet been renewed but when looking back on what we've heard about the show it does make me doubt certain things like it has high ratings and all of these other things about the ratings being so high if the ratings are truly that damn high why aren't both networks deciding to say hey you know what we'll keep investing in this we'll keep putting money into this because you guys are making us money back we're making money back off of our investment if the ratings truly are that damn high it should not be taking this long i feel like this show is being determined to get canceled because of the fact that it's actually not doing what they tell us it's doing a lot of people i know often will talk about how this show has high ratings this that and the third it might have high ratings in a certain regard but clearly not in a way that would stop networks from being this undetermined about whether or not they need to renew it or not and even outside of that i know there are a lot of you who don't even want the show to be renewed i myself don't even have a problem admitting that i don't actually want to see this show get renewed because i don't have any faith that the show will ever evolve from what it's currently doing as much as i love the trio as much as i love everything as far as like the legacy characters i feel like they have dropped the ball greatly when it comes to nika i feel like they are dropping the ball when it comes to giving us something that is balancing that line between being truly horrifying and also just being funny the way chucky has always been chucky has always been funny to a degree but that scary tone a lot of people want that back and then you have a fan base in which everybody is constantly saying oh you're a fake fan if you don't think chucky can ever be funny or you're a fake fan if all you want is for chucky to be scary when all in all we don't need to be arguing about it that much we need to look at the people behind it which are the creatives involved and just say that they are not doing a good job at the moment a lot of you might think they're doing a good job a lot of us also don't think they are doing a good job i won't i won't say that either side is wrong i will just also start to say this the people who think that they are doing a bad job with this show are not wrong if they think that now if it's rooted in some other personal things that have nothing to do with quality writing that's different but the people who are taking issue with the writing they are not wrong to think that a lot of people do think that this show is too wacky it's too goofy it does not have the same tone that those first couple of movies did and even if you're someone who enjoys the comedy to a degree the comedy can take you out of something like this when it's so over the top so willy-nilly so just outlandish i can say the comedy can be outlandish at times i love chucky I hope and pray that the show, if it's canceled, can at least continue some storylines into a movie. Uh, I think doing a movie would be best anyway, because I think that in the TV show format at this stage with what I saw with season three, I don't think we're ever going to see what we truly want. And when I say we, I'm talking about those fans who want to see Scary Chucky again. I don't think we're going to see that ever if this TV show continues. But we know Don has stated that there is a movie in development that movie itself can conclude certain storylines resolve whatever was going on with the trilogy or with the trio at the end of the second not the second but the third season where they were all turned into dolls and all that bullshit that can get resolved in the movie move on from those characters bring in one character or two from the trio if it were if it were up to me i'm gonna say the same thing lexi is the one who has connective tissue to still keep going she has a lot more mileage to her as a character than devin and jake who have been reduced to nothing in my opinion during that third season as much as i like those two i wish they had a lot more connective tissue to keep me rooting to see them go against chucky lexi has a lot more skin in the game at this point compared to those two and she can leave them behind in the dust regroup with someone like nika and her and nika can take it from here and we can introduce a whole new set of characters tie in some more legacy characters if you want to if andy needs to come back so be it but i know a lot of people are not going to like that the show is still up in the air when it comes to the renewal i will say that i think that it is going to get canceled i do think it is going to get canceled and if it's not canceled it at least says a lot about how much of a priority the show is to these networks the show just feels like it's on borrowed time even if it gets renewed for season four 
is it going to always be like this? It, it, it just does not feel that the show is that popular the way that it is. Because if it truly is that popular, why is it taking this long to get a renewal? It just doesn't line up with a show that is truly popular and dominating not only in the critic reviews, which that show has been dominating in critic reviews, but it doesn't appear to actually be genuinely dominating when it comes to stuff like Nielsen ratings. People don't seem to really be watching this the way that we think they might be. I know people in the horror sphere are watching it. I'm watching it. But truthfully, how many times in general do you hear people talk about Chucky? I'm sure a lot of you don't hear a lot of people that are not in the horror field generally speaking about Chucky. But let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications, and never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links on my social media accounts. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. I'm just in movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.